morning, everybody. It's July the 10th. We're down here at another field where we have bicolor corn. And if you look all the way at the back of this picture, we're pulling bicolor towards the back. You can see the, the tassels on the top of the corn there. And as you pan by, we got some little smaller. We actually got my father-in-law, Coy, on the tractor plowing this corn. People always ask, how much longer will you have corn? Well, we try to answer all the way till frost. As you can see, this corn here, 14 inches tall, we're laying it by with some fertilizer today. And it's 14, 16 inches tall. But I pan out to this other patch, it was planted a week after that. And we're at 10 or 12 inches tall. You see how clean it is? Real clean, we got this patch here. So every week we plant, every Monday morning we plant, white and bicolor, and this just happens to be the bicolor field. So we're coming over here, and we've got this field that was planted a week after that last patch. So this is something we'll do. We will probably plant for three more weeks. I was gonna show you the planting that we planted on Monday, this past Monday, today's Friday show you how fast things grow when it's wet and when it's hot i'm going to show you this quarter that i placed here and right beside it is a is a corn already emerged from the soil it's not all up but it's starting to come so this coming up monday we will plant another cut of white and bicolor plant to the first week in august and hopefully we can harvest everything by frost just want to let you know what's going on today we're picking tomatoes, corn, cantaloupes, squash, zucchini, pickling cucumbers, long greens, half runners, blue lakes, which are stringless beans. Uh, finishing up on our spring onions. We still got new potatoes. So just thought I'd let you know what's going on today at the Berry Patch, Ellerby, North Carolina, exit 25. Thank you.